Oh, wow. Hi, everyone. <laughs> I am piled to the top. So if you saw the description, you know this is a haul slash happy mail. And I've got so much here to show you. Sorry about that. Um, there was an interruption. Anyway, yes. So there, it, there are things here that I want to share. So, okay, we'll just get started somewhere, right? Right. So if you want to see what is contained in this big package and all the other packages around me, then just keep watching. Okay, so I'm going to start with the... Um, this that I just got in. Uh, these are some books that I got from christianbook.com um, and I saw these books on my friend's channel which is Sherry, Sherry from, Wholeheartedly from the Wholeheartedly for the Lord and she was showing these books and she in turn saw them on someone else's channel I believe. So let's just say it's enabling that's been handed down. <laughs> anyway, I was like, oh, I would love those. Just so you know, these are individual books of the Bible. And they're made by Crossway. And you can buy the whole collection, the entire 66 books, which is about, I think it was like 300 and something dollars. Or you can buy the individual books. So I bought what, what was on my heart to buy at the moment. And on my heart to buy was... Esther, I mean, um, Genesis, Esther, Daniel, Ruth, and Acts. Those are the ones that I wanted to start with. And when I say start with, it's going to be a while before I get through these, but I just want to show you what they look like. And it says scripture journal. These are just awesome. So it's the entire book of Genesis. And for each, um, let's say page, there's going to be a page of writing, but a blank page with dotted lines for you to journal or you can, you know, decorate it any way you want. So this is how it looks as you flip each page. So there are one page um, written scripture and then one blank page with just the dotted lines for you to write. I just love this. It's like you're just slowly taking a walk through the Bible and then you can journal as you go. So that is how this looks. And then there's extra pages in the back. As you can see, quite a few extra blank pages for you to do some more writing. And, you know, they give suggestions. It says, take sermon notes as, you, as your pastor preaches through Genesis. Record prayers as you read through, the, through God's word. Copy scripture to help you memorize specific passages. Write thoughts and take Takeaways from small group Bible study and family worship or one-on-one -on -one Bible reading with friends, co-workers, or neighbors. So those are just some suggestions. It's an ESV version. Um, and as it says here, uh, single column format, thick, opaque, cream colored paper. The paper has the texture. Um, if you have the Illustrated Faith Bible, it's it's the same same texture. So you can see it's it's trans it's kind of translucent because you can see some ghosting from the writing on the other side, but it's still thick enough to um, sustain watercolor, um, acrylic paint, and those types of things. Um, it's lightly ruled pages opposite each page of Bible text, wide margins, lay flat binding. Yes, lay flat. So if you open it up. Yeah, I won't cut. You'll have to give it a little. You have to work it a little bit. But once you do, it will lay flat for you. But this is just beautiful. I can't wait to get started on this. I have an idea what I want to do with them. And you will just have to wait and see. So yes, I've got Genesis, Esther, Daniel, Ruth, and the book of Acts. And then when they mailed it, they sent along their catalog, which I think is great. I mean, I will... You know, I generally use online, but then this is concise in their entire cataloging where it shows the, the discounted prices and, you know, if you buy bulk orders and things of that nature. So I was grateful for that. And then they also sent, I'm not going to show that, but it's a code for free shipping on your next order. Love this, love this, love, love, love this. Can't wait to get started in that. Just wanted to share those goodies with you. Then on Amazon, 
um, I was watching a video with Cat Woods and she was using these. So I was like, you know what? I want to try these out, especially for blending and like um, doing an ombre effect and things of that nature. So I got these Bible Safe gel highlighters from Amazon. Yes, eight acid free gel highlighters. They go on really smooth. And if I can show you um, where I tested out blending it, I don't know. Yep, here it is. So I was testing out blending it. This is just beautiful. This is me testing out the blending and the and how they blend. They blend well with each other. That's what I love. So this is the color. I also have a, a pastel set that's going to be delivered soon. So this was my buy from Amazon. And so you can see that again. It says Bible Safe Highlighters by Mr. Pen. So you can use them in your Bible. You can use them in your Illustrated Faith Bible, your Faith Planner, whatever journaling you want to use. And then next, so I'm going through the buys first. And this is the last buy. So I just recently got this in. And this was out of stock online at scrapbook.com. And I got these Prima um, marketing stamps. And this one is just so cute. So I've got this girl. And if you can see from the picture how cute she is and how they used it. I don't know how they did that in the um, stamping. Oh, they probably stamped this on cardstock paper and then fussy cut it out to give her that print. Cute idea. See the ideas you can get? It's got a butterfly. It's got a, a, um, a batch of florals. And then it has this little stamp here that says, hey girl. But the picture gives you much more of an idea. And they're pretty big because you can see the size of this. I wonder if it gives the measurement on the back. It doesn't say, but this is pretty big. This would fit like almost the entire margin of your Illustrated Faith Bible. Probably not a smaller Bible, but this would fill up the margin of an Illustrated Faith Bible. And I, this isn't the only one I've ha I have. I, I did get some more a couple weeks ago, so I'll show you those. I did get this one. I thought she was so cute. So I did get this one. I did get this one as well. Thought she was so cute. And they're named. So this one is Phoebe. This one is Tasha. This one here is Jayla. I like Jayla. This is cute. Smart and sassy. And it says, hello, sunshine. On this one, I'm not sure what this one says. I would have to open it. Let me open it up. But it's got this beautiful floral there. And this is a five piece set. So this one here says, rise and shine, gorgeous girl. Okay. And since I already have this one out, I'll just show you what the back of that stamp looks like. So that's what it looks like. So you, th these are rather large, unless you've got a huge stamp pad, you can take the small one and just tap it on the back of these stamps and make your impression on whatever uh, media you want to put it on, whether it's your Bible journal or cardstock, whatever it is. And you may say, oh my gosh, they're so huge. But guess what? You can stamp this on, let me give you a tip. You can stamp this on cardstock or watercolor paper, whatever you want to choose. Color it in, put it on the printer, reduce the size, and then fussy cut it out and use it in, in um, a Bible that may not be large enough to, to fit the stamp. There's a tip for you. Then the last one that I got was this one here. I love the flow of her dress. Does it give her name? Everyone has a name. Um, and yeah, I don't see a name on this one, but this one is a gorgeous one. I love the flow of her dress. So I got all of these from scrapbook.com. Love them. Along with the scrapbook.com order was a free magazine. So I've got this magazine here and it's just full of tips and tricks and some of the products that they sell and how you can use them. I just love it. How to do card making. There's so much information in here. It's got this beautiful card. I actually have that card. 
I love this cart because you can lay out your projects for the week and you just lift up each tray, do your project. If you've got Bible journaling laid that you need to um, do for the week, you can lay out your different Bible journalings on each tray, the stickers and everything that you want to use on each one. And just take the tray out, bring it to the table, do your Bible journaling and pack your stuff away and put the tray back. You can line up one, two, three, four, five, six projects in this We Are Memory Keepers cart. This cart was sold out on scrapbook.com and it's still sold out because they still haven't sent me the notification. I was able to, to get one on eBay and, I, and they're sold out on eBay and everywhere else. It was just fortunate that I was able to get it on eBay. There, You can't find the cart anywhere, but it's such a useful cart. So yeah, they sent me that magazine. And then they sent me also this little free um, thing. And if you can see it, it's like little ducks. But the ducks look sad. I don't know. Well, they're little duck pieces. And I have no idea what to use them for. It says yellow, cheek, yellow chicks. So it's got these little little chicks, chick heads, and I'm not sure what to do with them. If you have any ideas, please let me know. Um, I can't think of anything to do with them. I may just give them away because I don't know what to do with it. Look at them, and there's so many. I guess that's why it was free. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but that was my scrapbook.com order. Okay, so I've got this package here from my good friend Tanya. Um, here, um... Yeah, I believe she has a YouTube channel, but uh, we we um, communicate via Instagram and on YouTube. She's an awesome follower and a supporter of my shop. And she sells some jewelry and I purchased some jewelry from her and she sent this to me. And if you want to know how I kind of um, got this this address blotted out like this, it's because of this little thing here. So it's not working because there's plastic over this label. But on this next package that I'm going to open, you can see how it does this blotting out of the confidential. So you can use this little Excel mark, which I got from Amazon. So if you ever have to do uh, uh, unboxing or a haul or um, happy mail unboxing on camera, you can use the Excel mark, which is sold on Amazon. And it just marks confidential across the address that way you can keep that private not reveal any personal information so let's open up what Tanya has blessed me with okay I want to make sure I'm not cutting anything okay yeah okay, let's just see off camera here what's here Okay. Okay, she thanks me for her support. I thank you, Tanya, for your continued support of my shop. And, okay. So, let me show you my items first, and then I'll tell you what those two are. So, I saw this, and I was so, so, so in love with this bracelet. It's got, like, a, um, a gunmetal finish. Let's see if I can up oh, there we go I've got the tag so it's got like a gunmetal finish and I love it look at that bracelet isn't it cute it is so cute I love this so I'm a jewelry lover I have so much but I will continue to buy more and then these earrings go with it of course I'm not gonna put them on you're not gonna be able to see I'm doing a downward camera shot here, but these are the earrings that go along with it. Isn't this beautiful? I love this. This is so beautiful. Oh, I'm going to love this. I love this. I love this. So she sells the um, paparazzi jewelry and she is on Instagram. Um, I'll try to look up her Instagram handle for you that way if you want to go on Instagram and she posts the the jewelry on there for you to see let me not try to squeeze it back in the back I will have nothing but trouble and then these bracelets I'm going to open one she offered as a 
part of the giveaway. So if you're not aware, every second and fourth Thursday of the month, I've started a series called Thankful Thursday, and I'm doing it live on my channel here. I may change the time next month because I do understand it's the middle of the day. Some people may still be working even though they're still at home, but I wanted to give people more people the opportunity to take part. But what I'm doing is building a war binder and I'm giving it away. It's such a joy to do that. And it's such fun putting it together. Everyone comes on and we have such a good time. So she says as part of the giveaway of the war binder that I'm doing, she wants to give away also this bracelet and look at this. I love this. This says faith. Look at that. Can you see that? That is just gorgeous. This is a beautiful bracelet. So she's given me two of these to give away. Along with the war binder. And Trika over at Trika Plans has also do donated something else to give away with the war binder. So if you guys haven't seen it, then you don't want to miss out. Thursday, July 30th at 1 p.m., we will be announcing the winner. And if you want to see what's being given away, then be there and don't miss out in August because we're starting it all over again. So much fun. I want to see what this one looks like. This one says, be prayerful. Oh my goodness, this is gorgeous. So I know this is not mine, but I just want to look at that. Be prayerful. And then you put the other one on and it's going to hang and say faith. Oh, I love this. I love, love this, Tanya. Thank you so much for doing this, for being a blessing to someone. So let me tell uh, the person who gets this giveaway, they're getting a, a, a really nice first giveaway for Thankful Thursday because... I didn't intend for it to be like this, but it has turned into something that is just so beautiful. So that is what I got from my friend Tanya. And let me make sure I give you her Instagram. Um, yeah, she's just Tanya on Instagram. Oh, I'm sorry, Tanya8466 on Instagram. So if you go to Instagram, look up at Tanya, T-A-N-Y-A-8466, and you will see her post with all of the beautiful jewelry that she is selling, okay? All right, so let's move on to the next um, Happy Mail. We're done with all the buys. This, this is all Happy Mail now. So this happy mail is from Lakeisha over at Lakeisha Loves to Plan. And she gave me a beautiful card. I just love, love, love it. And she included this little bag of beautiful um, gems. Um, what do you call them? Sequins. The purple sequins. That is just beautiful. I'm going to keep that for, for, for a craft project. So I've got that. Boy, do I have a mess to clean up. I've read the card. I love it. I love it. I love it. And then she just, she's just giving me some goodies, some goodies. So let's just go through the box. So she gave me this beautiful, um, novelty clips and they're so cute. I love these. There's four in a pack. I don't want to be long winded trying to go through a little fast here. This beautiful journal and it's just a lined journal and the front of it says, amen. I've got this beautiful donut pen here. So it's a pen, it's got a cap, and it has a donut at the top. She gave me this beautiful, beautiful purse, this change purse. This is so cute. I love this. Look at that. I've got another pen here with wings. Love this. So I have my cup on my desk, and I've got all of these tall pens just at the top and I just lined them up. I love it. So I'm just going to stick this one and the donut one right in beside them. She gave me this beautiful scarf here and it has a hook. So you know where this would look cute. This would look cute hooked on your purse or pocketbook as I've been <laughs> no, known to say. I've, I've coined that from, from the island, island people. My mom says my pocketbook. She says bring my pocketbook. So I know to say pocketbook. So I'm going to put this on my pocketbook. 
<laughs> all right so this is beautiful and that's what I'm gonna do hook it on my pocketbook and she gave me this cute M I can put a I oh I have ideas for this M I'm not going to tell you but wait and see and then I've got this beautiful air freshener which is my favorite character Wonder Woman yes then she gave me okay I'm not sure what this is and it doesn't really say but it's cute it's got some macaroons that are lined up top to bottom with glasses on it's got some cute macaroons but I'm gonna figure out what this is for but it's like a jelly pocket thing I think it's what it, basically what it is it's just a pocket so you can put stuff inside yeah there's the foam inside so you can put stuff in here so that is cute then I've got this sequenced oh boy oh boy look at this and you can I already know you can just do like this ah look you can turn it from silver to pink this is so cute and it is a blank journal oh this is nice this is so nice Keisha girl you outdid yourself then we've got some pipe cleaners remember when we were younger we used to make crafts with these in school we've got some pipe cleaners I've got this cute panda pouch I love this I love it I love it I love it look how cute this cute little panda coin pouch or you can put anything in it for that matter but look how cute look how cute look at those eyes I love that then she gave me a set of beautiful, beautiful, gorgeous bracelets. Look at this. Look at these bracelets. And then look at this little emblem here that looks like it has the tree of life. Look at that. The tree of life. That's what that is. The tree of life. Not the tree of, of, of evil, but the tree of life. Ooh. Not the one of good and evil, but the one of life. I love it. Got another pouch. No prob llama. Love it. And it's got cards. It's got change area. I'm switching up these little change purses. I've got some sanitizer, champagne, apple, and honey. I've got myself a little chalkboard. So you'll be seeing this in, as you know, as a little prop in my videos. And then I've got last but not least a beautiful beautiful floral journal look at this oh I love the polka dots at the top and the bottom and the the pink lines this is gorge oh and look at the back there's some cards with this beautiful clip love this just some beautiful cards oh look at them look at the floral one like little journaling cards oh my goodness this one says friend this one has the scallop lines. This one has the zigzag lines and a, a plain part. And the back of them have like either checkered or dotted line for you to, to write. So I can use these in Bible journaling. Oh my goodness, yes. These, this, is a, this is great for Bible journaling. These little journaling cards. And I love the little paper clip that came with this. This is just awesome. Awesome. So that is... Oh, and look at this one. She made a heart. Look, Isha, you're just too much. You're so sweet. I love you, girl. Look at this heart. Look at that. Y'all need some friends like mine. Oh, look at this. Look at the heart. Thank you, Lakeisha. All right, so that is it for this box. But wait, there's a bigger box. There's another box. Last but not least, Lakeisha sent me another box. Let's see if I can pick it up. I may have to put you in pause to tear this one open. Woo! And uh, um, Lakeisha, I applaud you for taking on the challenge of wrapping this because I know it was not easy. But let's see what she has for me. goodness okay I'm gonna just tear into this and I will be right back okay this is the best that I could do oh my goodness 
I thought I thought I was done. I have to tear the plastic. All right, I'm gonna drag it out. Oh man. Whew. Oh Lord, that had me out of breath. All right. Uh, Lakeisha, you did a good job packing this box. We, we're we're going to call you over when we need to pack barrels for the islands, okay? So, oh my goodness, it is packed with such goodness I can see already. So, she recently went on a family, a, a Dollar Tree and a Michael's Hall. Michael's had grab boxes, not grab bags, grab boxes full of stuff. And she also went to Dollar Tree. So I believe these are the Dollar Tree items. Let's go through that first. Sorry for all that noise. So she did mention that she went to Dollar Tree and she found Dollar Tree is trying to break into the planner, the planner game. They've got um these disc bound planner systems yes they do so i've got this planner here and it's got she said the only thing she couldn't find was the paper for it so if any of you know where the paper for the dollar tree disc bound planners can be found or if you find them let me know okay so it's got a few of these just a few a month and then a few weeklies but she could not find more but this is just beautiful it's a pink and black polka dot over a marble background. And it says 2020. This is cute, I love this. Thank you, Lakeisha. And then there, there's these set of journals. These look like a, B, um, a B6 size. And this one has my initial. Do you see that? Now this specifically I know came from the um, Michael's grab box. This is gorge. Look at the gold and the blue. And then they have it in the polka dot. They've got the plain one with the initial on it, and that's me. I love this, love it. And I do believe I have a B6 planner I can fit that in. And then we've got some more stuff in here. Oh, so you've got replacement covers that you can put on the disc bound planner, and then some inserts. It's like some um, dashboards. These are the dashboards with tabs, so monthly, weekly notes, and then some extra tabs with um, nothing on them that you can put inside that planner. Then she gave me a little A6 book, which is beautiful because it's got butterflies. If you don't know anything about me, know that I love butterflies and florals. Woo! Butterflies, florals, mm hmm Yes. So that's wonderful. A6 notebook. This is something else that came from the Michaels grab box, which is this beautiful, beautiful planner. It's a recollections planner. It's vertical and the front of it says, we can get this off, unique and beautiful. Oh yes, unique and beautiful. And of course it is, let's see, it's a 2020 planner and it's vertical. At first glance, I thought it was like horizontal, but then it, it, it is, it's vertical. You've got the 27th, 28th, so it's, it's going vertically. So this is beautiful. And then you, I'm not going to flip through this whole thing. Happy is a state of mind. It's got beautiful little dashboards and it's bound. It's got notes section in the back and it's got a pocket in the back. This is beautiful. I love the floral. I love this and the gold writing. And then there's another planner. I love this. It's a 2019, 2020. And I know we're almost go we're halfway through 2020, but you can all, we, we redate things. We repurpose and redate things as planners. Yes, we can. I love this bit of rose gold. It's got these plastic rose gold disc. I just love the floral. Love it. And in the inside, I love this. Oh, and she included this beautiful, beautiful die cut embossing folder. 
So I've got a die cutting machine that I've been playing around with and we're going to be playing some more with it. So I love that. Um, I want to give you a glance at that. So yes, this was 2019, but this has got some beautiful pages. Oh my God, let the, look at this. Let courage carry you. Oh, wow. Believe in the good. So how the pages are set up, you've got your monthly here. Then you've got the weekly set up in, in vertical. This is beautiful, beautiful. And as a shop owner, I like having these different planners to use for measurements, for testing out stickers as well. So this works for me any which way that I want to use it. It doesn't matter that, you know, most of the months are gone. And like I said, Happy Planner has stickers big enough to, cut, to cover this. You can cover this any way you want and repurpose this planner. These are just beautiful. I'm loving the dashboards on them. I love the, the noted section, the important date section in the back. I love it. It's just beautiful, beautiful. So that is the planner that I received from Lakeisha. I've got this beautiful Blessings Bloom a 2021 inspirational calendar. Look at the florals. And this particular foiling is going into some beautiful, a beautiful item going in, in my shop. So, oh gosh, look for that. But this, this rose pink foiling, look at that. Blessings bloom. This is 2021. This is next year. But just look at the, uh, take a glimpse at all the beautiful floral layouts. And let me tell you something. She was laughing at me. I'm like, when the month is over, I'm cutting out that top page and I'm fussy cutting out those florals and repurposing them. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Then she sent me, this was all in Michael's $5 grab box. Head over to Lakeisha Loves to Plan's channel and look and see at that, um, look at her video, sorry. Look at her video and see what was, what all was contained in those $5 um, grab boxes. This was one of the items. It's a scrapbook. I've never done scrapbooking. This is going to be fun. And it says, so this happened with an arrow. So you have to open it up. And here are the 12 by 12 pages that you would put in here. Your cardstock pages with your um, scrapbooking, your memory keeping, whatever you want to do. And I love this bronze color on the inside of this. This is beautiful. And it ha it is covered in a nice sturdy plastic to keep the cover nice and clean and protected. And it's 10 pages included. This is going to be great. And also, I'm going to be doing some project life. I'm thinking more of a spiritual project life, but we'll see. So this was also included in her $5 grab box. This project life um, book set. So this is like a beginner set. So I'm just tearing it open and I'm not looking, but it says um, project life core, core kit is included. You have a photo, po um, photo pocket pages. I think there's two of them and you can add more if you want. We'll see. It says project life album which is this and she said and it says all of this put together equals completed pages so you see how the project life is you can include photos you can include journaling cards and then your little notes if you want to this is beautiful and then on the spine of it you can date you can put from when to when this project life applies I love this and I'm going to open it up Oh, I thought it was included, but you can purchase those items. I thought I heard her say it was included and then it looked kind of like it was included, but no, but you can purchase these items. So you can purchase the journaling cards, which is the core kit, and you can purchase the, pl the plastic insert pages to go in here. And that's how you build your project life set. So, you know, I'm going to get going on doing that. I can't wait to get started doing that. So this is the project life. This is big. This is huge, but it can hold so much as you can see. And I love this little divider here that says cultivate a good life and record it. And it says keep this sheet lifter on top to prevent damage to pages. I love this. And it's by Becky Higgins. That's the brand. Well, we've come to the end of the 
um, Happy Mail slash haul. And I just love, love, love all of my items, all the goodies, all the things that I've received. And it is just, it is just such a blessing. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing this. If you have any questions about the things that I bought, then please leave a comment below. Also comment below. Let me know if you have any of these items, how you use them, um, your ideas on any particular item that you've seen here. And if you're new to the channel, I hope you stick around and become one of the Vin Von Alley family by subscribing and hitting the notification bell. Anyway, guys, you have a blessed Friday and an awesome weekend. Chat with you later. Be blessed. Bye-bye.